Animal Equality investigated PNG Slay Pig Unit in Aberdeenshire, Scotland. We filmed horrifying scenes of animal suffering on the farm, which is owned by a senior pig industry figure, Philip Slay, a board member of Quality Meat Scotland. The pigs born on the farm are destined for slaughter at a nearby abattoir, contracted by giant meat company Pilgrim's Pride, who in turn supplies the likes of Lidl, Tesco, Marks and & Spencer, and many other major restaurants and retailers. On the breeding site, mother pigs are artificially inseminated by workers, a process they are forced to endure multiple times a year, so they repeatedly become pregnant. Some pigs were suffering with torn and swollen vulvas as a result of the years of forced impregnation and breeding. One was oozing pus, a clear sign of an untreated infection. Others struggle with painful and uncomfortable prolapses, resulting in their uterus or internal organs painfully protruding outside of their bodies. One pig struggling with an extremely severe uterine prolapse was forced to stand and walk for over one and a half minutes before being shot. Mother pigs on the farm are confined in cramped metal cages for weeks on end while they give birth and nurse their young. They're unable to turn around or properly care for their babies. The piglets routinely have their teeth cut out with pliers, without anaesthetic, causing several to develop debilitating infections. Well, that, oh, that's infection. Infection is going into the trunk because of bad teeth cut. Piglets' tails were also routinely cut off with a hot knife. They were given no pain relief. Some piglets don't make it and are discarded in bins. Those who are considered worthless because they are too weak or sick are slaughtered on the farm. In several cases, they are hammered to death. Others are swung against the hard concrete floor. And get the oxytocin. And a needle. Some show signs of consciousness, such as gasping and wriggling for many minutes after several blows to the head. In one case, a worker stands on the piglet's neck while killing her. Other pigs were forced to live in filthy, unnatural conditions. We found that some areas of the farm were flooded with water and feces, with no access to dry bedding for the animals. Pressure sores, hernias and other injuries are common. The pigs are roughly handled by farm workers.
In some cases, they are picked up or dragged along the floor by their ears. Workers shout, swear, and even repeatedly hit pigs with gates to try to move them. These pigs will be slaughtered at an abattoir called Quality Pork Limited, which is contracted by Pilgrim's Pride, one of the largest meat companies in the world that supplies 25% of the UK's pig meat.